Hey guys, Afmao here and welcome to Pixelmon Pokédex Conquest. Now, as you can see right off the bat, my party is completely or almost void of Pokémon. And there are some new Pokémon behind me because I've recently upgraded to the newest version which is 3.3. So, we're going to see some very interesting Pokémon that we haven't seen before in this series. Um, of course, there's been a lot with the update and we'll get into that. But for right now, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the board because I did manage to upgrade the board and like I said I wanted to basically put the order of the Pokemon so everyone can visibly see it instead of having to go to the National Pokedex and looking it up while you're watching this episode because I have a feeling that some of you do that but I'm not entirely sure so the next Pokemon we gotta catch because we caught Farfetch'd in the last episode is Doe Duo, Seal, Grimer, Shelder, and Ghastly so we're gonna have to get to work on that meanwhile I'm sure a lot of you guys have already noticed it but Lucas has moved and there's also a big something over there that I can't really hide. Lucas, what's going on? Holy cow! That's one huge Espeon. They can keep the lot. I'll finally, I'll find a new place to room, hopefully. And if we come up here, it's kind of hard not to notice. I mean, it's a big Espeon. Take a look. Seriously, take a look at how big that Espeon is. Oh my god, it's a big Espeon. It can get bigger too, I think. Espeon. Let's see, there we go. Oh, it's just like, oh, I'm not going to say anything. And this Umbreon, Espeon. I don't trust Espeon. Espeon. I'd love for Espeon to become a part of our club, but we can't fit him in the door. How troubling! <laughs> How troubling indeed. Down here, we've got the little uh, gang here, or at least the ma uh, the majority of the gang. We got the other gang up there. Got little Eevee. We got Jolteon and Vaporeon here. Um. So yeah, the Eevee club obviously is doing their own little thing right now, and they still have that that He-Man show going. So we're just gonna leave that. Leave that on. They, they 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 can conserve energy. They got Jolteon. All right, so let's go ahead and continue our quest to catch all the Pokemon in order of the Pokedex. But before we do that, because it just literally came into my mind, there's been a lot of new model updates. Or a few model updates. Now, I'm going to show you one because obviously it's the bird. The word is the bird. The bird is the word. You can tell it is my Pidgeot. Take a look at that beautiful, beautiful Beautiful bird, Jesus. Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. That model is just... And it gets even better because they changed the Pidgeotto model. And it looks... Fun oh my god, it looks so good. It looks just amazing. And I'll hopefully find the Pidgeotto. If not, maybe at the end of the episode, I'll spawn one in just so we can see it. But for now, let's not do any spawning Pokemon in. Let's just let's just go ahead and... Uh, oh my god, look at that flat. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. Now, 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 Pidgeot, please don't be a Derpazard and start messing up. That would be terrible. Oh, and here's our friends right here. The, 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 the Flareon dad and baby Flareon. I'm not sure where Flareon mom is. Not sure. Pidgeot, you're, you're a bird. You shouldn't. Okay, go take a bird bath. Whatever. All right, so we got Flareon dad here. And also, you can see right there in the middle, there's something of question here. And that is the breeding machine! It comes out, it is so cute. It's really, it's very much disguised, and it just goes back into the ground, and it comes out. It's disguised like a little flower, so it doesn't get in the way of all the Pokemon breeding. And I'm not entirely sure how to use this, so we'll, we'll give it a shot. Let's breed, let's, 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 do, let's do something terrible. Let's breed Venusaur with Charizard. See, can you guys fall in love? Is that possible? Or we okay? No, that's not pop. Wait, Charizard's like no, I can't. The love could never be. No, get get out of here. This 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 can never happen. Yeah, it, Charizard's just like nope, nope, nope. Not gonna do that. How about Charizard and Nine Tails? Maybe they haven't done a lot of extensive. Yeah, I'm getting way too ahead of myself. But let's see, Nine Tails and Charizard. Is that even possible? I don't think so. All right, so yeah, we have to have a male and a female. That's right. Sorry, I'm getting way too ahead of myself. But yeah, we'll experiment with breeding later. For now, we're going to leave it as is. We're not going to get into breeding or anything like that. I'll learn more about breeding off camera, and I'll teach you guys a little bit more. But for now, we're going to see. Let's see. Uh, what is this? Where do eggs come from? Okay. <laughs> oh, hilarious. All right. So enough dilly dallying around. Let's go ahead and get started. Let's go start by catching Doduo. Now Doduo is in the savanna biome, and I believe we have a savanna. Yeah, we do. Oh my gosh, amazing, awesome. Okay, so Doduo would be awesome. It would be amazing. It would be phenomenal, phenomenal to the max if a Doduo would just like subtly spawn right in my face. I would not mind that at all. It would be the most 
spectacular thing if the duo just popped right in my face. Like, right now. Right. Don't be shy, no duo. Just pop right in my face. Let's do it. Uh, wait. Get, get away. Get away. We can attack. Okay. Yeah. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't need that, Nidoran. And there's... I, I haven't seen any new Pokemon just yet. And if I did, I didn't notice them. So you guys have probably seen a few new Pokemon. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna really just, like, say it right now. Because I'm sure a lot of you guys have already... Look at the Sarg! They're, they're flying in the air! There's a Pokemon! There's a new Pokemon flying in the air! It's really cool. Um... Alright, so let's take a look. Let's take a look around. Obviously, you guys know that Whale Lord and Whale Mirror are in, in, in the, in Pixelmon. That, that's, that's a bit old. That's quite old, actually. So, don't worry about that. But there's a few new Pokemon that are just roaming around. Um, the newest one that they added, I'll actually spoil it for you guys. The newest one that they added is Corfish. And, normally found in the ocean biome, I believe. Uh, let's take a look around. I don't see any corefishes around here, but yeah, corefish isn't coming into the scene for a while. So yeah, let, let, let's just let's just keep looking for stupid. Do Why don't I just ride my Pidgeot? Oh, I'm I'm so silly. I'm so silly. Okay, Pidgeot, let's go! Vroom vroom vroom! Look at that! Oh my gosh! Look at this Pokemon. Now, this Pokemon has been in here for a while. Uh, I, oh my god, I can't I cannot pronounce the name. Bruvari. Bruvari. I'm dying. Br Brevary, there we go. All right, just, 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 just run, just, just, just run. Oh god, it attacked. It had a bird fight. There was a bird fight there, and it was the most deadly thing I've ever seen. Two birds going at it, just not something anybody wants to see. Two birds just pecking at each other in the face. It's not a nice sight. Nobody wants to see that. All right, so, so we're gonna get. I mean, obviously the Gen One bird <laughs> is the best bird. In my opinion, I, I I mean, I can honestly say that I think the Gen 1 bird is the best bird in my opinion, but that's just me. Also, you know, Bird Jesus, Twitch, plays Pokemon. It, 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 P Pidgeot's got a lot of rep behind him, so just, just put that out there. Just putting it out there. All right, Doduo, don't do this to me. Not right in the beginning of an episode. Come on, Doduo. We've got this. I've got you. I'm going to catch you. It's going to be amazing. Uh Oh, my God. I thought it was going to be... Amazing, but I guess it's not going to be amazing at all, actually. Um, we're working on it. We're working on it. So, yeah. One thing that about the line, I, I got really, really, really excited in the last episode because I was like, oh, man, I don't have to, like, like I don't have to worry about trading Pokemon for a while. And then I remember that Ghastly, or uh, not Ghastly, sorry, Gengar. Gengar comes from uh, Trade. So... Joke's on me, I'm actually going to have to end up evolving, uh, uh, Haunter via trade, so there's gonna be another thing coming up, and that's one thing I also wanted to talk to you guys about, was the fact that when I fought Garrett, I didn't really give myself a reward. Now, I'm actually going to leave that up to the viewers to decide, because if it were up to me, I would give myself a Master Ball. I mean, I would, but to be fair, it's been a while since since my lovely friend Garrett has played Pokemon, so I don't feel like I actually deserve a Master Ball, per se. So, maybe something like a little, uh, I don't know, I don't even know what I would get, which is why I'm asking you guys, or else I, I wouldn't. I would just be like, you know what, Master Ball, give it to me, Gen 1, Master Ball is a Gen 1, that's what I would do. And you know guys won't want me to do that. So, or at least I don't want me to do that. And I want you guys to help me out by stopping me. So, stop me from getting a Master Ball. Because if you don't say anything, I'm going to get a Master Ball. If it's, if it's up to me. If it's up to me. Don't do oh Seriously, I don't want to have to do a cut in the middle of the first of the, uh, part of the episode. This is so bad. Oh my god, if I don't get that, don't do Oh my gosh. I'm just... <laughs> Alright, you know what? Fall on the floor. Let's go to waypoints. Let's go home. Okay, go home. Pidgeot, I'm sorry. I just need to go home. I don't need this kind of stuff right now. That's a big Espeon. I can't get over how big that Espeon is. It's a really ginormous Espeon. And uh, let's take a look over here. By the way, I wanted to also let you guys know that the Espeon was not made. Uh, was is made by custom NPCs because a lot of you guys have been uh, debating about the size and stuff like that And I just wanted to basically put out in the open um most of the the pixelmon here are custom NPCs So that way you know exactly what mod is being used for the pixelmon Because uh, that's been a question I've been getting quite a bit and I just kind of wanted to clear that up with you guys So I hope that helps you guys out just a little bit Uh, let's go to Savannah Go to Savannah. Okay, there we go. There we go All right, uh I swear, don't duo. Twice the heads, twice the trouble. Am I right? God. 
Oh my gosh. How do you, how does the digestive system of a Doduo even work with two heads? Like, does this, I'm, I'm assuming that they only have, like, they probably don't have two of every organ. Uh, that's, that's, that would just be crazy. That would be insane. And, oh my god, my, so, oh my, I'm sorry. Oh my, Arceus! Why can't I find a freak? Oh, there it is, 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 there it is! Da! Ah. <sighs> Just one extra head that I needed. Thanks, Dotrio. Was that? Is that a Brock? That's a, that, 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 that's a wooden block. All right. So it looks like if Dodua doesn't spawn within the next five seconds, I'm gonna have to just speed things up a little bit with the power of editing, ladies and gentlemen. The power of editing, ladies and gentlemen. That's right. Get rid of all the tedious stuff that has to go on in between looking for, you know, not talking and looking for Pokemans and all that kind of crazy stuff. All right. So, last Star Duo was completely my fault. I can admit it. I am not a person who cannot, cannot admit things. I can admit things. Um, like, I chose some pretty bad Pokemon to fight trio, right trio. now. Just scratch it. Trio, Just trio, do some scratch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some pretty, pretty bad. Pretty bad Pokemans. Yep. Just, 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 just slap Doduo. And, and, and then, and then put him to sleep. Let's, let's do that. Let's, let's do that. Put him to sleep. It missed. That's fine. Okay. I, I don't blame you. You're now, do, now Doduo is asleep. All right. Let's use a great ball. Cause this probably will work. We could sure to use a net ball, maybe. I don't know. We'll, 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 we'll see what, what results this gets us. If it gets us Doduo or not. It was, like, yes. Yes. All right, quickly, let's go to the next Pokemon, which we're going to go, um, let's go home. Shut up. Wait, that's, that's a Savannah. That's not, that's not home. Wait, wait, wait no, we, no, we, no, we don't want to go, we don't want to go here. Just, 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 just go home. Just home. There we go. Okay. All right. So now we're home, and I believe the next Pokemon to catch is Seal, but I could be wrong. That's why I have a board, because I should have done this from the very beginning. But, um, yes, totally right. Okay, now Seal is found in ice area, and most likely around the rim of an ice river-esque kind of thing. So let's take a quick look around. I'm sure we are going to find Seal pretty soon. He's a pretty common spawn, but from this series, I think a lot of you guys know, if you're looking for something in particular, it's bound. There, you, you, you're not gonna find it. You're just, you're just not. That, that's how life works. The what you're looking for, it, 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 you don't normally find it like right off the bat. It is rare that, you know, unless you're like extremely lucky. See, that, that's a Celio. It's, it's not a, it's not a Seal. I mean, it's got the same name and, well, technically that could count. I mean, if they got like a similar name, would that technically count? I, I don't even know anymore. All right. Uh, seal, where are you? Come on, let's, let's do. Wait, is that a seal? Oh my god, no, that's a gold dean. That's a gold dean. Gold dean, stop, stop, stop impersonating. Stop, stop making me get fa my false hopes up. My my little false hopes. Okay. Uh, Magnemite. Nope, nope, nope. We don't need a Magnemite. Oh my gosh. All right. So are we really gonna catch two Pokemon in this episode? Oh, that's gonna be lame. Come on, I want to catch at least four. Four poor, ep four poor episode. Fur, fur per episode. Exactly. Yes, that. What I just said. All right. So there's some chocolate bars there. Um, swing nubs for those of you guys who don't like them to be called chocolate bars. Um, seal, seal. Like seriously, I, I saw a bunch of seal here the other day. Why are they just ah? Uh... Okay. All right. You know what? We'll be fine. We'll do good. It'll be fine. It'll be all good. Um. So there's an Empoleon over there. Um, well, well, Whalmer, yeah, well, not sorry, well, Lord, well, Lord, we got a, um, let's see, wait, it, can he spawn, let's see, Ice Plains, he can spawn on the Ice Plains, so it's not like, uh, I'm looking at the, at the little reference sheet that I have, he can definitely spawn on the Ice Plains, Ice Mountain, Cold Beach, Cold Taiga, um, we don't have Cold Beach or Cold Taiga, unfortunately, I bet while I wasn't looking, I just passed him up, didn't I, and now 700 people are screaming, oh, oh, what's that? 
Woo! Lucky block. Oh my gosh. All right. All right. Luck be a lady tonight. I, I need, I need, need this. I need, I need a seal or something awesome. Letter. Well, at least I can write a note to the person who is going to come on the next episode and uh, help me out with my Pokemons. Uh, that, 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 that would be something. That, that would be definitely be something. So maybe seal spawns at night. I didn't write that down. I didn't, there's a Pipla. Hey, that's actually pretty, that's actually pretty rare that I, I'm gonna need that, like, in the next couple of hundred episodes. Not hundred episodes, more like a few episodes. Oh my god, catching them in the order of the Pokedex. That's a challenge. That, that, that really is, a terrible, not a terrible challenge. It's, it's, it's a tedious challenge. It's a very tedious, very, oh, is that, what's that over there? What is that? Is that, is that, is that, oh, that's a penguin. Penguin! Oh, gosh. All right. So, oh, man. You know what? I'm going to allow it this time. This is the one time. One time. There we go. One time I'm allowing that. One time. All right. So, uh, because I believe it spawns during the day. And if it, ah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Seal it. Seals. Look at the seals. Okay, Pidgeot, let's do it. All right, it's Pokemon, Doduo. Since Doduo seems to be owning some stuff, we're gonna have Doduo come out. All right, so let's do quick attack. Uh, d wait, what? Oh, do what? Do 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 Doduo was still asleep, I guess. Okay, all right. Now let's go ahead and use a Pokeball on Seal. And if you guys remember, the one place I remember Seal from the most was in Cerulean City Gym in the first gen of Pokemon when Seal like had the ah! Cascade Badge. In his Sorry, I got really excited and really nostalgic at the same time. When Seal had the little badge in its mouth and, and the Cerulean sisters were just like, ah, she can like just take the badge. We totally don't want to fight right now because we uh, can't fight right now. Because, like, they didn't really give a good reason why they couldn't fight. I, I don't understand why that was a thing, but okay. All right, so now we have Grimer. Let's go ahead and see if we can catch Grimer. Now, I think the penalty that, I, or, or the reward that I should get for uh, battling Garrett should be a little bit less now because of the whole time set that I just did. I was just getting pretty frustrated. And while I feel bad about it, at the same time, I, 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 I kind of don't. I, I kind of don't. So, but I do believe that I shouldn't get a big reward because of what I just did. So, I'm fine with just getting, like, you know, a Master Ball. I think that sounds fair. Yeah. I'm totally joking. You don't have to give me Master Ball. Don't 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 even worry about it. Um, all right, but let let's continue our search. I won't do that again, and unless it's for competition purposes. Um, and I'm technically fighting time. Technically, I could come up with all the excuses in the world, but fact of the matter is, I shouldn't get a reward at all. But all right, uh, enough about that. Let's go ahead and try to find Grimer. So Pidgeot Bird. Bird, let's go. Let, let's find Grimer. Come on, we can find Grimer. Grimer shouldn't be too hard to find, especially in the swampland. I mean, uh, oh my god, please don't tell me it's gonna, it's gonna, yep, yep. It's always, 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 always when you don't want, when, you, when, when, you're, when you're looking for them. It's always when you're looking for them that you can't find them. It's always that, just always, always that. Okay. All right. Damn it, Grimer. I just... I've just been having the worst luck this episode, at least. It's at least a little bit better than the episode with the Venonette. And look! 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 There's Staravia! Staravia's over there! Oh, Staravia's over there! <laughs> Let's see. Uh, yeah, so Grimer... Staravia! Sorry. Sta Staravia. I mean, Staravia. <laughs> Oh, I can't stop saying that. Uh, is in the Swampland. So we should actually be running into a Grimer, like, right about now-ish or so? I don't know. Um, but actually, Doduo should be evolving at level 31, which this Doduo is currently level 29. So that's actually a very good thing. I'm not sure if Grimer spawns at night. That might be a thing, actually, if, if Grimer spawns at night. I might just have to deal with that. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and stop dilly-dallying and find Grimer. 
So I was a thousand percent correct in my hypothesis that Grimer probably spawns at night. So yeah, I, I that was my fault. So we have some Pokemon here that spawn in the night. Obviously we got Venonat, Coughing, Coughing, uh, Paris, and all those other Pokemon that spawn here at night. And like any moment now we're going to be running into a Grimer. There's so much purple going on in the swamp, it, 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 it's insane. Alright, so um, let's take a quick look see here. Um, there's just a bunch of coughings. Oh my god, and a Paris, and a, um, Paris. Is that a Grimer over there? Please let that be a Grimer. That looks like a Grimer. That looks like it would be a Grimer, right? And, oh my god, that's not a Grimer. That's not a Grimer. Grimer! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. Now, I wonder who smells worse, Grimer or Garboder? Because they both have the potential to smell pretty bad. But, uh, I, I remember Grimer being, like, the smelly Pokemon. At least, but then we got the garbage Pokemon, so I mean that, like not. Oh, oh, oh! There's some Grimers. There's some Grimers. There's some Grimers. Oh yeah, right on timers. Okay, all right. Level 15 Grimer. Grimer, I like the sound of you. Okay, Grimer. Let's go ahead and throw a Pokeball at you and see if we can catch you exactly, because that would be really awesome if you just got into Pokeball. Grimer, where'd you go? No, seriously, Grimer, where'd you go? Okay, well, that was a bad idea. Okay, so let's go ahead and bring Doduo out. Blam! And we're going to go ahead and use Quick Attack. Wow! Grimer, I had no idea. Alright, so now let's attempt to catch this Pokemon right now. Bam. Done. Mm -mm. 5-4-3-2! Yes! I told you! Oh my gosh! Alright, awesome! So, in this episode, we've managed to catch Doe Duo, uh, Seal, and Grimer. And while that's not our biggest Pokemon haul yet, it is at least a Pokemon haul worth noting. It's better than catching just one Pokemon per episode. And I like how Pidgeot just kind of went like this with its little wing. All right, so I did say at the end we were going to try to spawn Pidgeotto, so hopefully I can spell Pidgeotto correctly. Uh, let's see, Poke spawn Pidgeotto. Oh, oh look, Pidgeotto's actually fighting us now. Oh, amazing. All right. So there's Pidgeotto. Take a look. Now, it's not that stupid little block. Oh my gosh, that block was just the most... I, I don't even know how it went from, like, like beautiful model bird to block bird to, to beautiful model bird. It was just crazy. But look at Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto, oh my gosh, you are amazing. You look so beautiful. I just want to pet you so bad. Wish you were mine, but you're not. Pidgeot is, because Pidgeot's awesome. Alrighty, ladies and gents. Well, thank you so much for joining me for this episode of Pixelmon Pokedex Conquest. Remember, if you enjoyed this episode, to leave a like and a comment, and as well, let me know what you guys think about the whole Master Ball thing, if I deserve it or not, and just, you know, just, just saying and stuff like that. So yeah, basically, that's what I wanted to say. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you all are having a wonderful day, and I will see you all later. Take care. Bye-bye.